this commission will will take stand disciplinary action against any aspirant who breaches or political party which is in breach of the electoral code of conduct the commission calls upon all aspirants to show restraint and maturity in the way they address grievances concerning elections we do not contest elections we conduct them as ibc we will continue to provide an enabling environment for free, fair, and peaceful elections. Again, I want to make it very clear that this list which we have received by political parties and which we're going to publish on the website and the, to the other media is the one we received as of the 21st of January and we will not change it. The IBC has no power to change a list provided by the political party as at the deadline. In the same uh, way, it has no power to accept a new name or a new list uh, uh, given by a party after the deadline. In conclusion, and for the avoidance of any doubt whatsoever, this commission shall take any and all measures placed at, at its disposal by the law to ensure a disciplined and orderly electoral process. We shall enforce this to all irrespective of their standing or stature. We had the option of uh, stopping all political party lists by 18th. We had the option as a commission of stopping all uh, names coming to the commission after 18th of, uh, of January. But again, because of the, the conduct of the way the nomination were conducted, some of the parties were still announcing their results on 19th of January. So, regulation... Uh, 14 of the election regulations allows the commission a discretion to expand time for them. And so we gave them additional three days by midnight, the 21st of uh, January. And all the parties that were, which were going to take part in the elections, actually, some of them actually came around 11.30 a.m. with this uh, list of nominees. So if we had stuck to 18th of January, there will have been a serious uh, problem to the political parties. And of course, our, our job as a managers of election is not to put in obstacles against uh, political parties. It's to ensure that the, there's a good uh, level playing field for democracy to flourish and political parties who are following the law to uh, uh, bring their candidates to. In any case, like I said, we don't take part in elections. We conduct the elections. And these are the, uh, the players of the elections. So we are not, we didn't extend, uh, we extended by, because of the circumstances of the case and because we have the power to do that.